Larry D. Wilcox, born August 8, 1947, is an American actor best known for his role as California Highway Patrol Officer, later Captain, Jonathan John Baker in the television series Chi P.S., which ran from 1977 to 1983 on NBC. A Vietnam veteran, Wilcox races cars and is a private pilot. Wilcox was born on 8 August 1947 in San Diego, the son of Marion G. and John C. Wilcox. 2. He and his three siblings were raised in Rollins, Wyoming, by their single mother. He graduated from Rollins High School went to the University of Wyoming, then transferred to Los Angeles Pierce College. He eventually went to Cal State Northridge. He worked at different jobs including acting in Rodeo Cowboy, Military service. Wilcox enlisted in the Marine Corps in May 1967 and served in Vietnam during the Tet Offensive. 3. While in Vietnam he studied French and took general classes at College of the Desert during his final year in the Marines at 29 Palms, California. He was honorably discharged with the rank of Staff Sergeant in 1973. Entertainment career. Early years. Wilcox made a guest appearance in 1971 in Room 222. In 1973, Wilcox appeared in the Streets of San Francisco episode The Runaways as older brother George. Also in 1973, he starred in Lassiasdale, one of the boys who grew up there and was now working as a hired hand. Wilcox appeared in an episode of Canon Target in the Mirror in 1973 in a role as a witness. He performed in the 1976 film The Last Hard Men and other TV appearances including The Partridge Family, Hawaii Five-O, MASH, Fantasy Island, and Police Story, as well as commercials. He was the main, and only human for most of it, actor of a two-part show on the Wonderful World of Disney anthology show in 1978 playing a lone cowboy on a cattle drive and his adventures on route to market. He also played Emmett Dalton in the 1979 film The Last Ride of the Dalton Gang. G. P.S. Wilcox and Eric Estrada on Chips in 1977. Wilcox was cast as John Baker, one of the lead characters on Chi P.S., he was not in season 6 and was cast from 1977 to 1982. Wilcox performed many of his own stunts on the show. Unlike his co-star Eric Estrada, who played his partner Paunch, Wilcox never sustained any major injuries. By the 1979-80 season, he made $25,000 per episode, the same amount as Estrada, and it escalated thereafter. During his time on GPS, Wilcox appeared on the cover of TV Guide three times, along with Estrada. Rumors of friction between the two had occurred late in the 1978-79 season, but it calmed down after Estrada's injury at the beginning of the 1979-80 season as Wilcox came to his friend's rescue. Wilcox confirmed that some of the rumors of onset feuding were true, but minor issues were blown out of proportion. He added, we're just two totally different people. Wilcox is among the cast members who appeared at a reunion in Los Angeles to celebrate the series' 35th anniversary. Wilcox filmed the event and helped raise money for police officers and for kids at risk. Wilcox stated he called Estrada to invite him, as did Robert Pine, but Estrada did not return calls nor did he show up for the event. Estrada's manager said he was trying to establish a new and separate identity from Chi. P.S. After Chi, P.S. In 1982, Wilcox left Chi P.S. and formed his own production company, Wilcox Productions, which produced the award-winning TV series for HBO The Ray Bradbury Theater for five years. He developed, optioned, and sold to MGM The Yorkshire Ripper and sold to Columbia The Wolfman Jack Story. Later, Wilcox optioned Flipper and was the executive producer of that movie for Universal Pictures. He also continued acting and directing. Presently, Wilcox works with Saratoga Entertainment which is a production and digital distribution company. He also is a consultant to Enabledware, which is a rule-based digital distribution software in 57 languages with a focus on digital universities and security for sports stadiums. Wilcox was executive producer of the TV movie Death of a Centerfold, the Dorothy Stratton story. The story had a deeper resonance for Wilcox, whose older sister was fatally shot in front of her three children, her mother, and 17 witnesses. The accused murderer, her husband, was later acquitted in a celebrated trial in Wyoming and subsequently killed in a barroom brawl, according to Wilcox. 
He appeared in a 1985 made-for-TV movie sequel to The Dirty Dozen, called The Dirty Dozen, Next Mission. He played a convicted war prisoner Tommy Wells, recruited to help terminate a German general who was plotting to assassinate Hitler. Wilcox was reunited briefly on screen with his former co-star Estrada in National Lampoon's Loaded Weapon 1, and then again in 1998, where he reprised his role of John Baker, now Captain Baker, in the Turner Network television production of GPS 99. In 2008, Wilcox had a brief cameo in the music video for Rehab Song.